Hey guys, it's Jason with the Board Game Mechanics, and today we're going to take a look at a cool little rock, paper, scissors meets tic-tac-toe game called Toe Shambo. Toe Shambo is a two-player game that is gonna pit two players against each other, basically playing rock, paper, scissors, and tic-tac-toe at the same time. Each player is gonna have a deck of cards that are gonna have rock cards, scissors cards, paper cards, there's gonna be a bomb, which is cool, and there'll also be an undo card. So you wanna be the first one to get three of the same kind of your color, like three papers, three rocks, three scissors in a row, or you wanna be the last person able to make a move, and you are the winner. So, that's a quick overview. Let's go down to the table, see how it plays. All right, so here is a game of Toe Shambo, all set up mostly. So to get set up, you're gonna give each player a color. So this is orange player. You're gonna have blue player. They're gonna get this deck. And then you're gonna put this card here. It's gonna symbolize the center of a three by three grid. So you're gonna have three, 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 three. And essentially the way this game plays is you're going to play, be playing tic-tac-toe but with rock, paper, scissors. So let's go ahead and get started. So everybody's gonna draw three cards. You're always gonna have three cards in your hand, so when you play a card, you're gonna draw back up. We'll randomly pick who goes first, so whoever has the best card on this. So scissors, we'll say, beats that. And then we'll throw these cards on the bottom. We'll draw another. Reshuffle. You're supposed to play rock, paper, scissors for to see who goes first, but since I'm here by myself, that seems a little weird, so I'm not gonna do that. So I just did that. We did a little mini rock, paper, scissors battle. All right, so then we're gonna get started. So orange is gonna go first. So on their turn, they're gonna play a card. Cards look something like this. They're gonna have a type, which is rock. It's gonna have a color, and it's gonna have a symbol. So rock is always gonna have circle, uh, paper is square, and then scissors is X. And there's a bomb, which I think is like a, an asterisk looking thing almost. All right, so to get started, we are going to play a card. You can play a card anywhere you want to, to as the first thing. And you're trying to get all three. I, if I play scissors, I'm trying to get three scissors in a row, just like in tic-tac-toe. So let's say I'm gonna start ahead. I'm gonna put some rock. So I'll put rock right there in the middle. So I draw another card. Next player's turn. They want to also take control of the middle. So this is how you're going to battle each other. Just like normal rock, paper, scissors, paper beats rock, so they're gonna play paper on top of my rock. Then they'll draw another card. And let's see, so I'm gonna start working on some corners, so I'll play scissors right there. And then this player, they have another paper, so they'll play it right there, so that puts me on the defensive now. So let's see what we got here. So I need to put something down there that they cannot play a paper on. So I will put another paper down here. So that will block them because they need to put scissors there. So that works. So I will draw. Let's see. So they're going to go ahead and they will put scissors there so they can start working their way up the chain. And it's orange player's turn again. I'm gonna go ahead and play some more scissors, make them get on the defensive here. Blue player, they're actually gonna play this card, undo. That means you're gonna be able to pick the last card that was played onto the grid and it's out of the game along with this card. So they're gonna do this, they're gonna boot my scissors out, they're out of the game, then they draw a new card. Let's see, my turn again. So I'm gonna go ahead and smash these scissors because it feels like the fun thing to do. And it's blue player's turn. Ooh, that could almost been bad though, but it wasn't. So blue is gonna play rock. They're gonna smash my scissors. Draw another card. Then let's see. I'm going to play a rock right here. So I'm trying to work my way up to a win. So they're going to play, to play a rock right here. That's gonna block me, because I need to have three of my rocks. So let's see, 
I'm gonna cover their rock with paper. I'm trying to show you the one other special card and then we'll go up and see what we think about this game. Um, let's see. They're gonna put a rock right here. Draw another card. Uh, I'm gonna play a paper right there. So now they need to get some scissors, so they're gonna play some scissors right there because it's gonna keep me from winning. Draw on the card. Let's see. So I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play some paper. So I'll cover up this. Put that on the offensive. Alright, so then they're going to play another undo. They're gonna get rid of my paper. It's out of the game. Draw another card. Then it's orange player's turn again. They're going to scissors right there. Blue player's turn. They're going to scissors right there. So then I need to make sure they can't get scissors right there or they're going to win. So let's see. I will put my own scissors. Oh, let's see. I'll actually do an undo, and I'm gonna take these scissors away. It's done, so I'll draw a card. Blue player's turn. They're gonna do some more scissors. My turn, I'm gonna smash those scissors with a rock. And then flip that. All right, so now we have a bomb. Let me show you how a bomb works. So I'm gonna go ahead and play a bomb, which looks like this. So the way the bomb works is you're gonna play a bomb. So I'm gonna blow up all this stuff right here. Then that's it. And I'll show you what happens on the end of my turn or my next turn. So I'm coming here. I'm going to put paper right there, draw a card. Now it's back to this player's turn. When a bomb is played, all the cards underneath the bomb, including the bomb are out. And now this space is available again. And they're going to play a rock. That might not have been smart. They're hoping that I don't have paper. But I do. So I'm going to play this paper right here. And I'm going to win the game. Three papers in a row. Orange is the winner. So you're going to play like this until either somebody wins or one person is unable to play a move. And then the other person will win. So that is how you play Toshambo. Let's go up to the top and see what we think about it. All right, so that was Toshambo. This is a nice little fun filler game when you're waiting like in between big games and you have a buddy who maybe got knocked out of a game or something. You can go over and play this game in about 10, 15 minutes. Everyone knows how to play rock, paper, scissors. Everyone knows how to play tic-tac-toe. Takes 30 seconds to teach. You're saying, hey, get all the papers in a row, get all the scissors in a row. If you want to go where I am and I have paper, you need to play scissors. Easy, bomb, blows up a whole area, wipes it clean. Super simple. Really fun, really quick. I think we played like three games of it in like, I don't know, 40 minutes maybe. And that was just messing around even in between turns. So yeah, if you're into tic-tac-toe and you're into fun little card games where you can kind of get at each other and mess each other up, Toshambo is a game for you. So um, yeah, I can show you some artwork up closer maybe if you didn't see it in the, the playthrough. So here's a rock card. That's the blue player's rock card. Here's the bomb card for the blue player. Looks pretty cool too. And again, I mean, this paper, which looks like paper. It looks like Mr. Tally from South Park, actually. Remember that? Um, let's see what else we got. That's that. Here's the undo card, which is essentially just undo. And then there is scissors. Yeah. Simple. Simple art, effective, gets the job done. So that is Toshambo by Frank Alberts. They also did um, Pixel Glory, which is the dungeon crawl bidding game. So we did a review of Pixel Glory Light and Shadow that you can go check out on our channel. I'll link to it in this video. And so if this seems cool to you, maybe go find where you can check it out. Go or go find somewhere online where you can pick it up and just have a fun little filler that you can play with some buddies. So if you enjoyed this video, you can check us out on YouTube at youtube.com slash board game mechanics. You'll find videos from me, Joel, Kim, and Katie. We're also on Facebook at facebook.com slash the board game mechanics. We have a podcast that you can find at www.bgmechanics.com 
or just bgmechanics.com. Sometimes you have to put the www in there because it's picky. We're also on Twitter at bgmechs and we're on Instagram at boardgamemechanics. So that was Toshambo. Hope you enjoyed the review and keep gaming.